two remaining questions, Ian, for you. One would be, as a visionary of engineering simulation, um, what is your vision for the future of simulation? Well, uh, you know, near term, my vision is to uh, work with our new ANSYS friends and get as much simulation capability as I can into the platform and make it incredibly useful. And I, I want to make it so that um, new, newer engineers, the, the next generation of engineers will be so comfortable using cloud simulation that they would be uncomfortable going back to like, you know, trying to run simulations on a laptop like you did and having their entire laptop uh, lock up. Uh, and it's going to be really exciting. The best part of my job is going and talking to engineers and, and seeing what they're using uh, on scale to do. And then longer term, you know, I, I really think with the combination of uh, uh, AI, cloud simulation capability, cloud supercomputers, new hardware topologies, you know, GPUs, TPUs, ARM processors, you know, all this capability that's going to come from a hardware perspective through the cloud. You know, I, I think uh, engineering simulation is just going to get better and better, and it's really going to unlock uh, innovation for engineers. They're going to design amazing stuff like next generation EV tolls and hopefully rockets that you and I can fly into the moon or, you know, whatever they design, it's going to be uh, an amazing world. Yeah, really looking forward to that. And as you said, in six months, we'll see more from your side. So I'm really, really looking forward to that. Um, and the last question, and